the religion and uh, visual arts concentration at the Institute of Sacred Music and the Divinity School, uh, which is chaired by Professor Sally Promi, aims to provide students with a robust scholarly background in relations between religion and visual and material arts and culture. In the process, it also encourages interdisciplinary conversation across the various arts represented at the ISM curriculum. Visual fluency, the ability to understand, interpret, and contextualize the manufactured environment that most of us inhabit, is an essential ability not only for art historians, but also for musicians and clergy. A church building, for example, is a multivalent statement of the congregation's theology, taste, style, as well as politics and wealth. Even if one's church contains no art whatsoever, as it is the case with Mark I Chapel, this also conveys a particular theological assertion. And in our classes and in our research, we are very interested in, um, uh, these, uh, in the conveyance of these visual messages. After graduation from the program, many students pursue doctoral degrees in departments of history of art or religious studies or uh, museum careers. And our course offerings include uh, visual fluencies, material arts and Western visual cultures of religion, the cult of saints in early Christianity and the Middle Ages, religion and the performance of space, and uh, visual controversies, religion and the politics of vision. Our program values immensely first-hand experience and thus invites students to take advantage of the abundant resources of Yale University. And these include, of course, the uh, Yale Art Gallery and the Beinecke Rare Room and Manuscript Library. And courses routinely include visits to these collections as well as to museums and pertinent sites in New York City. Exhibitions organized by the ISM also play an integral role in our teaching and research. In less than a week, we will open an exhibition called Byzantine Icons in the Postmodern World, featuring works by George Cordis, the uh, preeminent iconographer in uh, Greece and I would argue in the world. We have a sample of his works exhibited here and I invite you after uh, we're all done to come and appreciate uh, uh, the beauty of these uh, uh, panels. Um, and uh, um, he's also, uh, Cordis is also very well known for his uh, monumental work uh, decorating churches uh, throughout the world, including um, the uh, United States. And exhibitions, the exhibitions that we organize are very useful teaching tools in uh, my courses. I invariably talk about wooden panels that contain uh, sacred images, uh, Christ, uh, apostles, uh, and whatnot. And it's one thing to show slides and another thing to take the class down the corridor and show them an actual object. Thank you very much.